one stick of butter over medium heat. I'm next coming in with our XL Hershey's Milk Chocolate Bar for this delicious, fun little dessert recipe. All right, and I'm just gonna go in with my spatula. And we're gonna start to give this a stir and let everything melt. Oh my gosh, this chocolate butter combination smells delicious. All right, and we're coming in with one cup of our white sugar on top of our extra large Hershey's bar and our stick of butter. And again, just gently stirring. And now we are going over low heat. All right, we took this off the heat and we are just letting this cool down before our next step. Our chocolate butter sugar mixture is room temperature. Now that we have that at room temperature, I'm gonna come in with eggs. I'm going in with two eggs right into our saucepan, just like so. We're gonna give that a nice stir. And you have to make sure that your mixture is at room temperature. If you do this while it is still warm, you'll end up with scrambled chocolate eggs. So you wanna make sure that you're nice and patient before mixing in your eggs. All right, now that we have our eggs incorporated into our saucepan, I'm bringing in our chocolate pie crust. And I'm just going to take our butter, sugar, Hershey's chocolate egg mixture, and I'm going right into that pie crust, just like so. I did the chocolate pie crust. You could totally feel free to do the original graham cracker. You could make your own even. Um, I know that Pillsbury, they do like the refrigerated ones too, but this is just the one that you can buy in the baking section. It's super convenient and always tastes delicious. Make sure we don't miss any of that. Just give it a little pat down. Make sure it's all evenly distributed into our pie crust before we pop this into our oven for about 20 minutes at 350. Oh my goodness, our chocolate lovers little pie has come out of the oven. We let it cool a little bit. We have this like brownie like crust. It looks so delicious. I'm gonna go in with, of course, my pie cutter. Oh, and that crust has like a nice crispiness to it as well, which is exactly what we want. I am not the best pie cutter. I can wholeheartedly admit that. So just bear with me while we try and get a lovely piece of this chocolate dreamy little pie out. All right, like I said, it almost has like a brownie consistency. Oh my goodness, my mouth is watering. That actually wasn't too bad. It smells like a brownie too. I mean, it just looks so delicious. We need some whipped cream, of course. Oh, I mean, how decadent and delicious does that look? Like I said, I did let it cool, so we're gonna go right on in. I want some whipped cream, of course. Oh, I mean, that's just like the perfect bite, too. Mmm. Ooh, really, really good. You gotta try it. <laughs> 